Hello everyone, this is Josef Notch here and welcome back to the third video in the Linux Pro playlist where I introduce you to Linux commands which might be very important for you. So in this third video it's going to be a short one, I want to show you two commands and how, first is how to change your password and how you can add a new user. So for example, if you want to add a user for your little brother or your colleagues or your parents on your uh, PC, why you would do that, I don't know, but maybe you want to do it, how you can do that, okay? Now we are here with the Ubuntu background and now what I'm going to do, I will go to the left hand side and open up the terminal. You can do this also by pressing Control alt T and now we want to change the password. So the command was passwd and now you have to type in your current password. I'm going to do that. And as you see, I just typed in the password, but there are no dots, no stars. So you don't see the actual characters which you typed in. So if you don't see anything, this is perfectly okay. Now I press enter and now I have to type in a new password. And now retype the new password. And now the password is updated. Okay, so now what if you want to create an additional user? So your colleagues, for example, um, or anyone else or in your, somebody in your family. So the command is add user and then, for example, test, test user is the name of or the name of the command whatever you want so if i type in now enter we get an error message that only a root so the system administrator has the rights and the privileges to do that but the user which you set up during installation has automatically these rights so but the test user will not have these rights so if you want to add a user with root privileges then please google it you have to modify the privileges, but Google it, you find a site and then you can find the commands which you want. But now you can just add a normal user by typing in sudo and this gives you privileges. Now you have to type in your new password. And now uh, um, Ubuntu is asking for the password of test user so this is not your password and now you can just type in anything and then give it uh, this uh, password to your colleague and uh, he or she should always change the password with the command passvd so we cannot type in anything and retype it and then you can type in a full name i'm not going to do that the room work phone home phone and the information is correct, yes, and now we set up a user. So I know that this is very handy, for example, at the university where I used to work, just because I worked with Linux all of a sudden, within half a year I became the system administrator of everyone, so this might also happen to you at your university or at your company, so these two commands are really handy. So I hope that you found this video useful and that you liked it. I would like to thank you for watching and listening and I hope to see you in the next video.